We've talked about how many businesses reduce risk by using derivatives. But don't derivatives also increase the risk to our global financial system? After all, the notional amount outstanding of the swaps market is $480 trillion. That's about twice the amount of wealth in the whole world. But what does notional amount really mean? Hmm. Notional amount is a rough measure of derivatives trading activity. It does not measure the amount at risk. The gross market value of these instruments is a more meaningful measure of risk, and that comes to about $15 trillion. Still a large number, but compare it to the size of the global bond market. More than $100 trillion. In addition, a number of factors work to reduce derivatives risk even more. Legally enforceable netting agreements that bundle together obligations between counterparties lower derivatives credit risk to about $3.3 trillion. Since the financial crisis, regulators around the world have put measures in place to make the market even more robust and resilient. Nearly all derivatives today are backed by high-quality collateral that can be used to cover payments which are due but can't be paid. Most derivatives also have to be cleared. That means a strong clearinghouse stands between two parties to a trade, guaranteeing payments if one of the parties fails. And today, we have far greater transparency. All derivatives have to be reported to regulators, giving them a clear view of who's trading what. It's important to understand the size and risks of derivatives and their ability to help firms efficiently and effectively manage risk.